Hey, what's up you guys? Welcome to another video. Thanks for checking in. So today we're gonna do a, uh, a front end rebuild. I'm gonna replace the oil, clean, clean out the shocks. Uh, I'm probably gonna paint my fork tubes as well or like the fork tube holders, whatever you call those. Um, and just kinda get that looking pretty again. Oh, so pretty. So stay tuned, cheers. Oh my god. Bruh. Bro. Okay, so I'm just gonna paint my fork tubes and put them back on the bike. The dust cover and oil seals aren't supposed to be here for a while, and my forks aren't actually leaking, so it's not really a big deal. I still wanna rebuild them, but I'm just gonna put that off for now. Uh, so that will be another video of like, maybe a how to build your forks on these old, you know, uh, dual twin Hondas. Um, but yeah, there's an update for that if you're wondering why that wasn't in this video. All right. So a quick hack on getting rust off of chrome and like old metal parts is literally just a little bit of water and aluminum foil and you'd be like incredibly shocked how well this works that's that's one thing i learned on the interwebs a while back and been doing it ever since take a sheet model it up a little bit dip it in some water i'm assuming it has something to do with like the polarity of water to help get oxidized iron off of your chrome So you can already see that line right there that I took off. It's like insane how fast it works. That's what she said. Hey Siri, what's the weather look like? It looks like you're gonna need an umbrella, it's a little bit drippy. Yeah, so basically we just ended up painting the fork tubes and adding the fork gaiters and cleaning up the Honda emblem and stuff. Um, not as much as I would have wanted to get done, but I'm still waiting on the oil seal, so that's just gonna be another video. Um, but thank you so much for watching, you guys. Stay tuned for the next video. And if I can build a bike, you can build a bike. Cheers.